Today's horoscope from Astro Academy, Aries April 23, 2023. With the moon in your sign all day, you're focusing on your emotional needs more than usual. Watch for seeking instant gratification rather than recognizing genuine emotions. Feelings you've set aside or buried to deal with other issues in your life can rush up to the surface now. Mercury begins its retrograde in your sign today, and some introspection can be beneficial now. Watch for overthinking, which is a strong tendency now. Even with a recent new moon and the sun's move into your sign, it's better not to begin a brand new project, as it will likely get off to a slow start or can be reconsidered later. During Mercury's retrograde until May 14, there can be delays, misunderstandings, and a lack of clear messages. This cycle is more personal for you, and you should take extra time making sure you're clear in your communications. Decision-making turns inward, and intuition often reigns over pure logic, which can be quite beneficial in spots. It's a good time to reorganize and reflect. You are looking at the world a little differently, through different filters, and can come up with some very important inner revelations. You are a focused animal when you want to be. You know that you have the perseverance to overcome anything. However, today will make you feel like your patience is reaching its limits. Mental Mercury, our cosmic messenger planet of the mind and communication, is now frozen within the night sky before he begins a nearly month-long backward crawl through your zodiac sign. This could feel like you're ready to tear out your hair and howl at the moon. Because it is causing us to collectively review themes around self-worth, possessiveness, and how we share, we will also have a moment to see how our relationships reflect these themes. You might feel increasingly scrambled over the next few weeks. As of today, Mercury will station retrograde in your sign which will cause some disruptions in your work life and astrological season. Mercury retrograde is the perfect time to rethink, review, then revise, so this might be the perfect cosmic opportunity to reposition yourself at work. You may need to hold yourself accountable for how you come across, but this could help you improve your standing as a professional. It could even help you adjust your appearance to fit your new and improved professional identity. In the lead-up to the moon's return to your income sector tomorrow, this is an important point in any month for having your antennas up while taking a wait-and-see approach. Even more so when this is not only the moon's only visit while Venus, the planet of money is here and this will give her and you a better sense of where the money is, but with a chance to act as a trigger or just to provide more insight across the income and career fronts. Balance your diet? There is almost nothing more boring to you than the thought of doing something that nurtures you alone. You'd much rather nurture someone else and have a relationship based on that. Whether it's your diet or your exercise routine, it's important to create a relationship with yourself that is encouraging and brings some excitement about staying healthy. If you prefer to be with other people, sign up for an online nutritious cooking class or join a virtual chat about exercise. This day can really add to your feelings of attractiveness. You can have a lot of fun with this. Perhaps you have been wanting to try out a new hairstyle or outfit. Maybe you haven't been entirely sure if this new look suits you. This is an excellent day to just go for it. You are almost certain to feel and look great, regardless of whether you don silk or burlap. The moon's return to Taurus just before the sun returned to begin your birthday month and new solar year two days ago was a chance to ensure you were emotionally and intuitively engaged from the start. The moon was also here as Mercury turned retrograde yesterday, leaving you with a better red on his sense of where you have been and the sun's red on where you are going. Yet with the moon returning next month as a new moon and with a lot of water set to pass under the bridge between now and then, there is no pressure and instead a chance to relax into the journey. Having the moon in Taurus when Mercury, the planet of communication turned retrograde here yesterday has already given his mission to give the past and unsaid words a voice a head start. That the moon is spending its final hours in your sign at a friendly aspect to Ceres, in retrograde motion in your romantic sector is adding to the focus on the past, just as you have moved into your birthday month and new solar year. Our eyes in the sky.
The arrival of Mercury's retrograde phase in Taurus today provides an excellent opportunity to focus on financial stability and success. Taurus is renowned for its strong connection to material wealth, so it's an ideal time to examine your finances and take control of your money. Creating a budget that is tailored to your unique lifestyle is a great way to establish financial security and independence. Being mindful of your spending habits and saving for unexpected expenses can also help you feel more confident about your financial future. With a positive attitude and a sense of self-assurance, you will radiate an energy that attracts others towards you. As you continue to take on challenges and assist those around you, your impact on the world will become more noticeable. You may find that your willingness to help others earns you a reputation as a go-to source for advice and assistance. Maintaining a healthy lifestyle can also contribute to your overall sense of well-being during this retrograde phase. Regular exercise and healthy habits will help you feel your best, and may even encourage others to adopt similar routines. As a motivator and positive force, you have the power to uplift those around you and make a significant impact on the world. With Mercury retrograde in Taurus, it's the perfect time to take the reins and steer your life towards greater success and happiness. So embrace this period of introspection and focus on the things that bring you joy and fulfillment. You have the potential to make great things happen. Jupiter and Eris are still aligned in your chart, driving you to pursue financial success and fight for what you deserve. This is a powerful time for manifesting abundance and making progress towards your financial goals. You may feel a newfound sense of contentment as you resolve personal issues and embrace a more adventurous spirit. Be open-minded and curious about the people and experiences that come your way, as they may offer valuable insights and opportunities for growth. It's important to take care of your physical health during this time, as well. Regular self-care practices like sauna sessions, yoga, or meditation can help you build resilience and stay energized as you pursue your goals. When it comes to financial matters, take a cautious approach and avoid overspending. By remaining modest in your needs and focusing on small profits, you can save up for something truly meaningful. This is a time of empowerment and growth, and you have the power to create a fulfilling and abundant future for yourself. Stay focused on your goals and trust that the universe will support you in achieving them. With Jupiter and Eris on your side, there is no limit to what you can achieve. Embrace the journey and enjoy the rewards that come your way. Don't be surprised if your partner pays you compliments for no apparent reason, or if you are single you get far more attention than you normally expect. Others find you more captivating and alluring than ever, and this enables you to flirt outrageously. Your instincts are strong and draw you towards opportunities which ultimately result in success.